this tutorial I'm going to show you step by step how you're going to tag earlier on I've tagged this Shanghai onto this position here using Panoramio in Google Earth so I'm going to show you the next one I've tagged this earlier on I'm going to show you how I'm going to tag this now Xi'an City click on it once I click on it this is Xi'an City and I'm going to map this photo click on map this photo so they'll prompt me where is the place city and place I'm going to key in Xi'an China search and that is the location I'm going to zoom in zoom in the position so that is confirmed I'm going to press save position so once press that this is the photo taken by me located down here and this one is taken these are taken by the rest so it's all here so I managed to geotag this Xi'an and now this is the latest one which I've geotagged or tag it next thing to get into this you have to sign in or sign up for Panoramio and of course the usefulness of Google Earth it's going to take some time for it to open up Google Earth I'm going to show you in wake of Japan disaster how tagging, geotagging is so important. This is Fukushima nuclear power plant. This is one, this is two. If I'm not wrong, yes, one and two. These are all being geotagged. So if I click on it, it will open up the picture. This is Fukushima, first nuclear power plant. It's all done using Panoramio. Close it now. These are the picture taken. Close this. And let's look at another one. This is reactor 3. This one here. That's another one here. That's, that's another one. Okay. So the usefulness of Google Earth in geotagging. Hope you enjoyed this simple video tutorial. Thank you.